fellow Sudokans, and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Friday the 29th of November 2024. I hope you are okay. If you were trying to design a Bond villain and you had to have some cartoonishly evil person, could you actually do better than choose your model as Vladimir Putin? I think not. I think he's the perfect Bond villain, isn't he? Um, you can imagine him stroking a cat and strangling the cat at the same time, I think. Uh, anyway, he has uh, given a message. He knows how to play Trump so well. I mean, we've seen this before. It's a repeat performance. You remember when they disappeared without the American translator? They disappeared. Was that Oslo, wasn't it? When they disappeared into a room with only Russians president, uh, present. Sorry. <laughs> Oops. Only Russians present. Apart from Trump, who may be an honorary Russian. Uh, anyway, um, he's now uh, Putin has now offered a message to Trump, and he knows how to play him so well because two things he said. First of all, he called him clever, and that always works with Trump. As long as you, if you call Trump intelligent, uh, the most obvious <laughs> low intelligence person that has ever occupied the White House, and they've had a few. Remember, there's George W. Bush, and there's uh, you know various other people who have been. Uh, I would say well below par in terms of IQ. Um, that he, if you call him clever, that he loves it. So that's the first thing. You know, get on his good side. The second thing is he said, noted how Trump is not safe. Uh, in my view, he's even now he's not safe. He said. Um, I hope he realizes that. So uh, yes. Uh, now he's supposed to be referring to his the the assassination attempts on Trump, and of course Putin is uh, variously accused in various countries of being uh, the person behind uh, actual murders of political opponents of Putin or journalists in various countries, and um, um, you know um, credibly accused as well. I would assume. So, uh, you know, there's that threat behind. So there's this, you know, I oh, yes, Donald, you're very clever. And also, Donald, remember, uh, you're not safe. And, you know, Trump is really a coward. I mean, that's the point about Trump. He's like all bullies. He's actually a coward at heart. He's just full of bluster. So um, Putin knows perfectly well how to how to get over, how to p get one over on Trump. And uh, it seems like he's going to succeed. Anyway, uh, as I said, it's kind of cartoonishly evil. But unfortunately, we are in the real world here, not in a cartoon. All right, let's get on with the game of Sudoku, shall we? This is the Los Angeles expert level Sudoku puzzle for today. We're going to start with sevens, lucky seven. Seven in that square there. What are we doing up here? We've got sevens blocking across here, sevens blocking across here, seven blocking up there. That's going to be a seven, isn't it? I've suddenly noticed this grid seems a bit empty. Does it feel a bit light on digits, starting digits to you, or is it just me? I never bother to count, but it just feels like there aren't that many there. Six is blocking down here and across there. I could be wrong, of course. I'm not going to bother to count. It doesn't worry me that much. Six blocking up here, six across there. There's a six. Six down. Uh, oops, come on, get it right. Up and across there. And I see a few digits across here and a couple of spaces here. What have we got? Nine, that's okay. Five, yes. Okay, five and nine blocking across here. That's going to give us a pair of five and nine down there. So fives will go in those squares. And nine. Oh, that's the only nine on the board, actually. 
so no further information on nine all right so we've got five and nine so this is not five or nine it's got to be three or four so again threes go up there and fours go in those squares there and this is not three or four it's got to be one well it can't be one so there's the blocking one and this is not three or four so it's going to be eight eight across this way and eight down here will give us eight in this square there hello hello I see something eight here eight there eight there and eight across here so in the right hand column column nine there's our eight eight this way eight that way eight down here we get another eight and that's as far as we can take them because we'll be left with this pattern so either here and here or there and there we'll find out later so we've got seven and three blocking across here so this is a pair of seven and three we've got three blocking up there so there's the three and there's the seven and the last digits to place here are one one blocking up here here's the one and the last number here is the five I just thought of something this is the expert level game isn't it? yeah it is I'm just double checking <laughs> on the other screen okay five blocking across here five across here there's our five and this will be nine because we have nine blocking across there like so missing digits here are eight and four missing digits up here are two six nine I think okay and we've got six blocking this square this square and this square so that's the six and the two nine will be somewhere there and no it can't be because two are blocking up there will give us two there and the nine in that square missing digits in this column are one four five we've got four and we've got five in the same row so that's our one We've got six and eight here and six and eight there so that's our pair of six and eight isn't it and so we should look across here to see what's left that's two three nine I think two three nine uh, the only help there is the three it's three up here two three nine okay uh, so six and eight can we get anything else here what do we know about the ones there two there six eight okay so we've got three down here three up there that's going to give us three in that square So ones will be here and there. Twos will be there. Five, I don't know. And nine. Two, and that's two nine, isn't it? This is, okay. All right, let's let's think about this this is six eight because of the six eight blocking here and we've got two and nine blocking 
here. So that means these squares have to be 2 or 9. So this must be a 5 for this column because that's 2 and 9. Okay. 5 across here, 5 down here, 5 down there. There's a 5. 5 this way, 5 that way, and 5 down here gives me 5 in this square. 5 up, 5 down puts a 5 over here and 5 across here and 5 up here and we know this is 6 and 8 so that's the location of 5 and we know this is 2 and 9 and this is 6 and 8 and so this is 1 while going around the clock. Or it might not, because we don't have seven in this row. We've got seven blocking here, seven, there's seven blocks this square, seven blocking here, seven blocking here. So in this row, we've got seven in that square. And we've got four blocking this square, four blocking this square, so here's our four. Four this way, four that way, there goes a four. Four down here and down there, there's a four. Three blocking across here and across here gives me three in that square. The last number to place here is nine. Four blocks this square here. We need a four in the first column. So we'll put it there and this will be a nine. Nine across here. Now you remember we had two and nine in those squares. So the nine is going to be there. The two is going to be there. 2 blocking across gives us 2 in that square. Missing digits here are 1 and 3, and I don't know which is which. But here we've got something we can find, which is 2, I think. 2 blocking down gives me 2 here. There's only one number left in this column. Is it a th No, it's not. Is it a 9? Yes, it is a 9, and we need a 9 for this block, and we need a three up here so the middle section is all done and we are making good progress I think we'll just click on the digits that we still need we need one can we get the ones as they are not sure two we need can we get the twos we've got two across here so we can get two in that square there and that is finished we still need threes we've got not sure. Four. Four blocks across here, so that give me a four in that square. And four blocking up puts four here. And the last number to place there is an eight. How about the fours? What else? Where else? Yes, four blocking up here. There's the four. And the last number there is three. Three down puts three in this square. Missing number there is a one. One down gives us one in that square. And the missing number here is nine I think okay one blocks down here that gives me a one in that square the missing number here is six six blocks up here give me six there eight there oh a very easy puzzle for the expert level uh, f from the Los Angeles Times today that's it uh, thanks for joining me uh, remember to subscribe to the channel and uh, click the like button and all that kind of stuff that Sudoku, um, Sudoku, I mean YouTubers always ask you to do. Thank you for that. Take care. Bye-bye.